Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? I am Enrique. How's life? Hope you're, hopefully you're doing really good. This is easy pictures to draw. Uh, hopefully everybody's doing really good right now. Um, yeah, let's go over the drawing. Today we're going to go over how to draw a cute anchor. You know, an anchor like from a ship. Uh, there are cute versions of that. Uh, using my favorite marker right here, the Faber-Castell. Amazing, because it has no smell at all. I love it. Uh, you can check the, you can buy it on Amazon. I'm gonna, the description is in... The link is in the description if you guys want to buy it on Amazon or just look it up uh, yourself as well. Faber Castell, uh, P I T T Artist Pen. Uh, also, let's get started. Oh, before that, a word from our sponsor Armadillo. Armadillo pencil case. This pencil case is something that, uh, you know, I created a long time ago. It's amazing, it's fun. Uh, you can put your pencils along the line right here, grab this side, and then place it on any sketchbook. Or, if you really want, you get dorky and put it on your wrist, which is what my buddy does all the time, to kind of carry pencils around. Mostly when you're sketching out, like, you know, in public places. It's super fun. Uh, I don't know. I use this constantly. It's my thing. So, anyways, next thing, arm-adello.com. Check that out. So, let's get into the actual drawing of the anchor. So, do -do. right here. We're gonna start with the, the kind of lower shape first, the largest curve. The largest curve tends to be possibly the hardest, so I would kind of get that out of the way. Arrow at the end. Pulling up for the center. It's kind of U shape. Uh, middle portion that's going to hold it in. Pulling out. You're kind of replicating complicated, uh, not semi complicated iron kind of stuck together but in a simplistic form. So it's kind of like a box with a little stick coming out of it, like bolt, like a Frankenstein bolt in the neck. And that's what's holding these two sides, essentially a bar across the middle. And then the top as well. Something near this would be good. It doesn't have to be exact. We keep something near that. Mostly the crossing portion of it. And the little uh, the thing at the top, which is held by a chain normally. And I'm going to put little legs on it. This is the cartoony legs. Schoolhouse Rock. I'm going to put eyes on it. Eyebrows. Some shine in that eye. Smiley face. The the build of this uh, particular anchor is uh, the reason that face is gonna be smaller on it. Where like in the other ones, the face is huge. But because we only have a certain amount of space, I'm gonna put that on. Uh, the bottom there. Kind of throwing another extra line over the contour. That's just kind of like my thing. It is a stylistic thing that I really enjoy. Steal that up. It's a stylistic thing that I really enjoy. I think it makes it look a little bit more like a sticker. And there you go. Thanks a lot. Uh, it's really simple. Simple. Really simple. Thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate you watching. Uh, hopefully, it was simple enough to follow along. I want to make that as easy as possible. If you really want, you can put little hands, these little stick figure like hands sticking out, which is something I've done in the past. You can make them do whatever you want. So, anyways, thanks a lot, guys. I'll talk to you next time.